Descriptive Statistics. In this session you will learn how to run some basic descriptives. All the procedures you need are in Analyze, Descriptive Statistics. Descriptives are measures that contain summary information about the data you have gathered. We will look at two kinds of summary information, frequencies and measures of central tendency and dispersion. First, frequencies. This summary information tells you how many observations fall in each category. Your variable sex, for instance, consists of two categories, male and female. The frequencies for that variable tell you how many males and how many females are in your data set. The category with the most observations is the mode. Let's check the frequencies for the variable sex. Go to Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Frequencies. Select Sex. Click on the button that says Statistics and check the mode. Click Continue and OK. Now the Output Viewer opens and displays your results. On the left you have the Tree View. It is useful for navigation when your output becomes very long. On the right your output is displayed in detail. Let's look at the results. The first table says that your variable sex contains 10 observations and no missing values. The modal category is category 2, which is the male category. Remember that in the last session we coded female as 1 and male as 2. The second table tells you how many observations you have in each category and the percentage distribution. If you don't understand it, right click on the table you want to understand and select results coach. A tutorial opens which walks you through a frequency table. Let's close the tutorial and do some measures of central tendency and dispersion. When you have interval scale variables, such as age, you may want to know what the mean or average age is. Perhaps you are also interested in the highest and lowest value. Finally, you may want to know the distribution of the variable by looking at the standard deviation. So go to Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Descriptives. Select Age and click on the Options button. Select Mean, Minimum, Maximum Standard Deviation. Click Continue and click OK. Again the Output Viewer opens. It has appended the results of your current procedure to the frequencies you ran earlier. As you see, the youngest person in your dataset is 21, the oldest 56, and the mean age is 31.5 years. The standard deviation is 12.286. Once again you have the option of using the results coach by right clicking. To save your output click on the save icon. Your file will be saved with the filename extension .spo. When you try to open this file, SPSS will recognize it as an output file and automatically launch the output viewer.